Uh, yes, Captain, how's um, camp been going for you uh, after the off season and first day of practice and, and pads and so forth? Going good. I mean, uh, working my way back in slowly, starting to pick it up again. Uh, but going good. I'm uh, really happy with what I'm doing, learning the playbook really well, and uh, trying to, you know, ramp it up a little bit for myself. Coach kind of said he had to, like, hold you back. You heard that before. How tough is that to kind of, you know, know you got to be on the pace? For, yeah, uh, you know, for pretty tough right now for me because uh, uh, I, I want to be where I want to be right now. I, I need to be at a, a certain – I think I should be somewhere right now. And uh, I'm not used to getting held back a little bit. I know I have a little something going on, but uh, I'm ready to, you know, start working and, and, and you know, getting to be where I need to be. Charles? You've had uh, plenty of games where you've been the number one receiver on the team. Is it different for you this year as you, your first camp without Cody Oakley as a good veteran guy? Uh, uh, I, won't, I don't want to say it's different. Like you said, I had some games without, you know, Jones, and uh, I think I'm ready for that role and uh, more, more than ready for that role. And uh, I just can't wait to, you know, to make plays and, you know, do what I have to do for my teammates. Michael? How is the play? Like, does it feel 100% good? Are there still things that you're like, mm, Yeah, uh, my foot is totally, definitely fixed. Um, it was not good last year, and it is definitely fixed this year. You're, you're very adamant about that. Maybe yeah, it, it's... Was yeah. there a point last year where you really, like, maybe in the offseason when you look back, you're like, oh, wow, yeah, that really wasn't... Yeah, in all seasons, I was really worried about myself. But now, I, 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 the best thing I could have did was get the surgery, and uh, it really helped me. Zach? Uh, Calvin Ridley with an injured toe puts up numbers like you did last year. What do you do this year? How do you uh, Help my team win games. Help my team win games. That's, that's what I can do. What are your goals? You said goals? Goals are pretty personal right now, but uh, my main goals are helping my team win games. Thoughts, Calvin, on uh, the ability of the, the wide receiver core when it shapes up to draw double teams with you and Pitts and, and Hayden and, and really having a really threatening core. Yeah, that. I'm really, really excited about my room. Uh, we have tons of speed in there, tons of guys who can make, you know, a lot of plays. And uh, I'm just excited, just, you know, for the world and for the football world to see the rest of the guys we do have and, you know, watch them, you know, explode into the, you know, football world with the plays they can make. You guys are as big of a wide receiver core, obviously, without some guys that aren't here anymore. But what are some of the advantages you have having the, the guys that you do have? In the uh, we're real wide receivers. Uh, we have skill. We got skills. I mean, we can we can pretty much do anything big and small receivers do. We can beat press. We can play zone football. We can go up and get the ball. And, uh, we can catch and run. We can do it all. So I'm really excited for what we got. And uh, I'm happy for everybody to see. Aside from the on-the-field stuff, just how have you embraced you know, guys coming up and picking your brain now with trying to, try to see how you think of things? Just how have you embraced that role? Uh, I'm pretty sure uh, most of the guys, I've, they've been here. A lot of the guys, uh, they've been doing that. Um, I'm one of the guys I think they would come to and ask me for advice. and uh, it's, it's really easy to, <laughs> to do it when you, you, know, you know what you're doing on the field. Michael? Yeah, I got two for you. One, what, what so what advice are they asking you? Like when they come to you, like what are they saying? What are they really they just saying? saying, what do you see? You know, what, what, what would, what, what you would have did? Um, what should I've done? Um, and that's really it. And with Kyle Pitts, I mean, I'm so many people have heard a lot about him. Yeah. You had me to see some of them. Yeah, we well. Is it a different <laughs> deal when you yeah. watch him in person? Like, what's yeah. that like? Yeah, me and uh, Kyle, we work at a, at the same facility, Adapt. Uh, I've been seeing him all all season. So he's he's a large guy, you know. He made, he's really big, he's long, fast, and uh, he's been making plays for us. And we, we're we're very excited to have him on the offense. So. Oh yeah, taking is, you a different has it like been kind of at a different level for you seeing him even in this type of environment? First, like with pads? Yeah. Like this with is the first day I've seen everybody with pads on. So, yeah, I mean, very, very, like I said, very excited about Kyle and what he can do for the offense and what we could do together to help the team win games. We got time for a couple more. 
Justin? Hey, hey, Calvin, in addition to being, you know, a leader uh, within the team, I heard the, those kids calling their names yeah. the entire practice long. I mean, we've been seeing 18 jerseys for years, right? Yeah. What's it going to be like being the guy, being the center of attention, you know, on the field, off through the city? Uh, same as last year, I want to say. Uh, just got to, you know, embrace it, take it in. It feels pretty good. But uh, like I said, I want to help this team win games. I mean, get back to winning. You know, we want to win the first game of the season. We haven't done that in a while. But uh, just get, get back to winning games, really. Zach? Other than the level of music in terms of the volume, uh, what's the big difference out here at practice? Um, yeah, uh, it's a little different. I mean, the structure of the practices are totally different. I mean, obviously, we have a new coach, and uh, it's his practice style. but. I think uh, the way we're doing things and with the weight room and all that stuff, I think we're going to be a totally different team, stronger team, bigger team. Uh, it's just going to be a lot better for us. Awesome. Thanks, you guys. Thank you all. Thank you.